Hello everyone and welcome back to New Tech. Today we're going to show you how to connect your Xiaomi Mi Band 6 with Xiaomi Wear and iOS. Xiaomi Wear is the app like we said that we will use today. As you can see we have four pages down below. We have status, workout, health and profile. In the profile you can see the Redmi watch is the last watch that we connected. Now we press add new device, the Mi Band 6 is the new watch at the top. So we press it, you can see it found immediately. Now we have to agree and we have to wait until the, uh, they are paired with each other. You can see phone is connected to the device, it, it hits check. We have a verifying signature, you can see now we have to allow in the watch so they can connect. After that we have verifying signature as we said and we have add account, you can see already the watch is connected and it's powered on. We have to press pair in the Bluetooth pairing request, allow the notifications and all the stuff that uh, the Xiaomi Wear requires and press done you can see now that they are connected we can go ahead and see all the details that they teach us to use it now the Mi Band 6 is activated to use and ready for all of its options in the first page we have statistic page uh, my status we have the steps as you can see we have day week and month statistic all the statistic for all the options will be in this page so we will see a lot of statistic here after that we have the calories same again we have day week and month calories also my activities at the bottom we have workout history which you can see here at the beginning of the page we have sleep data as well day week month statistic but as i mentioned before we don't have any statistic right now, the watch is brand new, which makes it very hard to work with because we usually use the watch a couple of days so we get some statistic and see how the watch will work. You can see the hard rate statistic day, week and month. I noticed that in the iOS Xiaomi Wear uh, app is not working properly. We have uh, a little bit delay in the statistic data as you can see the stress now we have day week and month statistic again uh, as well as the PAI standing time and we have the blood oxygen down below so these are the options that we mainly will use and we have them in the first page with all the data that we did so it's much easier for us to find them at the second page which is workout we have the last workout data which we don't have any of them we have outdoor running treadmill walking and outdoor cycling if you press go you will enter the sport mode at the third page as you can see is all in chinese which we can't use at the fourth page which is profile we have the first option which is band display where we can find a lot of uh, watch faces for the mi band 6 Let's try a couple of them and see how they look like. Let's find uh, the one that we think it's very good. You can see now that they are loaded. We have plenty of them, plenty of different styles for everyone. So don't worry, it, it will, you will find something that it fits you. This looks pretty good. It has pretty good colors. You can see now it's sizing immediately. This won't take too much time. So let's wait and see how it will look the new uh, watch face that we found. It's already done. You can see it didn't take too much time. Now we have a brand new watch face which looks pretty good honestly. And you can change how many times you want. So uh, that is not a problem. Back at the menu where we can find the solution for iOS users. So in case you need anything. You will find right here we have alarms which we can set from here we have event reminder goal alert app notifications when you allow this it will show you all the apps so you get to choose what apps do you want to get notification from and which one you don't 
Next we have find band unlock device which it has the same option as in the Android and we have additional settings health monitoring, idle alert, risk preparation, uh, race to wake, risk detection, night mode, widgets and a lot of more options which you have to go and customize for yourself and these are very helpful so you get to customize however you need them. So guys, this was all for today's video. I hope you find this video interesting and helpful. If so, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you in the next video with another smart device.